Hi, welcome back to a new vlog. Oh my god, it feels weird vlogging, but you know what? I did ask you guys on Instagram what you want to see on my channel, and so many of you said vlog, so I'm going to do my best, even though my weeks aren't very eventful, but I'm going to do my best to vlog on the weekends for you guys. So anyways, I'm making lunch. We did get an air fryer for us because everyone raves about it. So we got the Ninja, I think this is the 400 one. Um, and I put sausage and then we have some potatoes and carrots in one side and it's literally the best thing like this cooked in like 15 minutes it's so honestly best purchase that I've made in a very long time <laughs> I definitely recommend having an air fryer <laughs> ignore the hair it's super oily i'm gonna wash it in a bit but we're gonna do a little unboxing because i've got a new vlog camera my current one has served me well but it hasn't got 4k i'm kind of bored of it to be honest and obviously i just want to like up the quality a little bit so i got the sony zv e10 which i feel like a lot of people have but it's considered the, like the best in terms of vlog camera especially for like beginner intermediate level because i'm no camera expert so just let me film and let it be good quality like i don't need no technical stuff one thing i really like about this vlog camera is that it has a wide lens although mine says 8.8 .8 millimeter which is quite zoomed out this one's 16 yeah 16 to 50 anyways i'm going to compare the two and see if there's an actual difference and then also one of the main differences is that with this one i can uh change the lens if i wanted to whilst with the one i currently have is the canon g7x mark ii i know there's a mark iii which does 4k but again you can't change the lens okay this one already feels a bit more bulkier it doesn't feel heavy but it's definitely different to what i'm used to and it's more it's bulkier because obviously you've got the lens attached here and then also another thing that's really different is that the screen comes out on the side like this whilst mine comes on the top i kind of prefer it coming on the top but anyways it's fine but yeah this looks pretty pretty sleek look at that brand new screen the battery is way chunkier than what i have currently so hopefully the battery life is a bit longer i literally woke up from a nap but the camera has been charging this whole time so let's do a comparison this is the old one and this is the sony one it's not as um wide as i wanted it to the canon's actually wider because this is 16 to 50 millimeters this one's um 8.8 .8 to 36.8 .8 millimeters the lens to be honest i can see a difference in quality like, i'm gonna be able to see every single detail on my face with this it's really smooth i don't know i really need to play around with this i don't know like i'm a bit i don't know how i feel this is my hand with the canon one this is my hand with the sony Sky. guys that was such a fail because i did a bit more research and i just i'm not feeling this i'm such a canon girl at heart so i think the camera's gonna go back i'm not liking it at all um it's so shaky and it doesn't have it inside like installed uh image stabilization so i don't know i just got ready we're gonna run to this and we're gonna watch a horror film called megan apparently it's gonna be really good so we're gonna do that and then i'll talk to you guys about the camera stuff when i get back but just a bit gutted to be honest I was really excited about that. I'm just super casual, so yeah, I'm looking forward to the film. Guys, it's now the next day, and I know I thought I said I was gonna vlog once we got home yesterday, but um, I was just too tired. It was like past midnight by the time we had a late dinner so um, i'm gonna do my nails because i'm over this blue one i think i'm gonna do try and do uh, french tips and then sort my hair out clean the kitchen and then probably film for the week 
because your girl has to bulk film for the week because in the week i literally have no time to do anything overall the film was pretty good megan um it's about a robot doll <sighs> has to look after a kid and then it just shows you the story but anyways the film shows exactly why i i don't think i can support robots in the future like they're scary as hell like they have to make them in plastic or something so in case something goes wrong i can defend myself you know it was a pretty good horror film i probably wouldn't watch it again i probably would rate it a 7 out of 10. horror films are hard to like top off i think if you want a good horror film watch barbarian oh my god that was creepy af and there's a evil dead rise coming out later this year which looks crazy so anyways i'm excited for that one we got this new candle and i've never tried wooden wicks in a candle before and when you light this up it legit sounds like a fireplace we got this one from tesco i don't know why like it's so messy but um we love this it's done now but it's a uh, neroli and bergamot but i think i also really like um their orange blossom one i think these are just from tesco it was really good but yeah let me light this up and show you guys can you guys hear that put the volume up it's literally the most relaxing sound it's like rain i find rain the sound of rain is so relaxing and this is literally the same i really like it Oh my god my hair is such a state i'm not gonna lie i had a really nice relaxing weekend which i definitely needed God, it's so we haven't had sushi in a long time yum i don't like normal soy sauce to be honest this is the one to get from sushi gourmet the sweet soy sauce but first let's back up already on the faroe islands Wait, each one an impressive mound of brown sugar flour and salt Plus we discovered lime coke zero and, and it's Johnson. pretty good just the fishing industry in general is good morning guys it's now the next day i'm working from home today so i woke up a bit earlier so i could just clean up a little bit last night i managed to finally finish the time traveler's wife and to be honest i've always said that i'm not a fan of storylines that go back and forth in time sometimes it can be a little bit hard to follow i find but to be honest one of my favorite films is interstellar which is one of the films that just made me it just blows my mind like the concept of time it's just it's insane but anyways it was a good read i'm gonna go watch the series now because there is a series on it I think it's only season one but it was okay like i would probably give this like a six out of ten it didn't it wasn't a page turner which is why it took me so long it took me months to finish this so i'm gonna move on to the next book but if you're into books this is basically about a guy who time travels and he meets someone and it just talks about their story and some bits were really nice i really like the ending to be honest so yeah six seven out of ten for me i also got a bunch of pr I got some bits from Huda Beauty. This is like a conceal bake and snatch set. So I got like some setting sponges, a hand mirror, a sponge, like mini sponges. These are cute. The faux filter concealers, one of my favorites, and the easy bake in the shade banana bread, which is the one I use. I then got some cleansers from Tatcha. I cannot wait to try these. Like Tatcha skincare is worth the coin. Like it's so good. I actually need to purchase some of the moisturizer, the purple one. I might actually film with these today, but I've got a bunch of lipsticks from Hourglass. How cool do these look? I'm just gonna pick like a few shades that stand out to me and just try them but the packaging is so sleek 
Isn't that look so nice? Oh, I love like chili reds like this. Oh, she's a beauty. Look at that. Yeah, I'm just gonna try it. Maybe all of them, I don't know. Got this, all of this skincare from Pixie. I have so much Pixie skincare and this one I feel like isn't really for my skin type. I don't know. I'm I'm just not feeling this one, so I might keep this for a giveaway. And then the camera. It's all packed up and it's going. I wasn't a fan to be honest. I'm a Canon girl. I don't know what I was thinking, so I'm probably gonna get the G7X Mark III. But I'm gonna do a bit more research. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know but this one I just like it's easy I can control the brightness I was a bit disappointed so yeah that's the camera situation and it's super foggy today like even yesterday it was foggy all day guys you can't see it, nothing this is my breakfast today I usually have a sweet breakfast but it's eggs today and I'm we ran out of milk, so no coffee or tea for me today. It will just be this. That's ice, guys. It's like minus four degrees right now. So on my way to the dentist, I'm gonna get a my just routine checkup and also probably try and get measurements for for a crown on a, for one of my back teeth. I'm so over teeth. Like it's not even anything to do with my front teeth. It's more my back teeth that give me more trouble than anything. But um, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Hey guys, I know I look super weird right now, but I was just filming a video comparing two setting sprays. I was testing out these two setting sprays, which are really well known. But if you want to know what I thought, then follow me on Instagram and TikTok because that's where you'll find me a lot. But to be honest, it might go on as a short. It might go on as a short. Yeah, I've been really sick the past week. I've had like a flu or something and then that led on to a chest infection I still have and it's just so hard to talk for longer periods of time as well. So so yeah, I've just been having to deal with that. I'm just gonna I've run out of makeup wipes. I need to wash my face, but let me just take this off because this is ridiculous. And guys, guess who copped Beyonce tickets? <laughs> I got Beyonce tickets. I'm going to be going with my sister, but when I tell you this has been a dream from the Destiny Child days, I used to have the CD with the lyrics on the booklet, I used to know all the words, and now I'm going to Beyonce's concert, like what on earth, this is going to be, like the fact that we even got any, when I tell you, my sister was a backup, but I had three screens open to cop those tickets, and we got them at a reasonable price, at a reasonable sp spot, seated so i pray that nothing wrong happens and that we can go and enjoy this and experience it to to the fullest and i'm literally so excited we actually have a few concerts booked for this year i managed to film a few videos i'm going to try and continue to film but i'm going to make some lunch now
right i think i'm gonna call it a day i actually did quite a lot today but i've got quite a few clothes to fold up and then i'm just gonna chill i deserve it okay because i filmed so much and maybe just have some more chicken curry later on and that's it really all right guys i'm pretty happy with the vlog um i'm gonna end it here so um i hope you guys enjoyed it and uh, hopefully my next vlog is slightly more eventful probably do some bits outside but i hope you guys still enjoyed this one and i'll catch you in my next video bye